Okay, I can't believe this. Am I seriously about to beat this thing? Yes. Okay, I'd like to say that I feel accomplished actually pulling this off, but here's the thing, though. Here's the thing about this fight. It was not a legit fight. You might have noticed it for just a few seconds. But... Um, Simon is usually a pretty slow character. However, this can be changed. You probably can't see it, because it's not showing up um, uh, on the thing, but there is a debug um, that lets you change various things, and one of them is this. Yeah, suddenly he's not so slow anymore. You can activate the... Uh, um, debug to activate the run trigger, which is basically only used for very specific chase situations, but you can activate it whenever you want. And this gives pretty much anyone super speed. Like, like, yeah, this is kind of absurd, but useful. Useful, but absurd. Um, and that's the only way I can actually beat the, uh, Yeah, excuse me a moment. You have to go through quite a few of these to get to the end of here because... There's a lot of rooms in this. This place is fucking huge. There we go. Fuck. I did not mean to do that again. Let me get back on the thing here. But yeah. The reason that I managed to ever pull this off is because I'm super fast. Faster than the Metroids are. And the Metroids are usually pretty damn aggressive. It can usually catch up to you in a hurry. But, but with the super speed on, you can easily swipe them and pick up the rock. You have plenty of time to react, as opposed to before, where you had to rush to the rocks to hit the guy. But yeah, well, I missed, but, but my point stands here, though. All the trouble I had before was that I was always feeling too rushed. Whereas now, it's the metrics that are rushed. Now, this part can still be a little annoying since he does the whole uh, electrocution shit. But as long as you're very precise with the hits, then... Oops. Okay, this might be bad. Well, actually, not really. Okay. I still managed to pick that back up before another Metroid managed to enter the fray. Ow. Although I am taking more hits than I did that one time. So I might lose this one. Yep, but... But anyways, I've proven my point, though. 
That's the only reason I'm I'm doing so well is because of the issue of um being fast enough to to keep up with the fight. And that's where my rant is coming in here. Not many characters have that kind of speed needed to keep up with the action. Not even characters like Sonic or Tails can really do that well. So, I, I really feel that the hardest thing about this fight is that everything just comes way too fast. I mean, the fight itself um, feels like it could be salvaged, but considering it's going to be replaced at some point, I really don't think it's worth it. Just wait for the replacement fight, which I assume is going to be Ridley. So, there you go.